The Wolf Amendment is a law passed by the United States Congress in 2011, named after then United States Representative Frank Wolf. That prohibits the United States National Aeronautics and Space Administration from using government funds to engage in direct bilateral cooperation with the Chinese government and China-affiliated organizations from its activities without explicit authorization from the Federal Bureau of Investigation and the U.S. Congress. It has been inserted annually into appropriations bills since then. In May 1999, the report of the Select Committee on U.S. National Security and Military Commercial Concerns with the People's Republic of China was made public. It alleged that technical information provided by American commercial satellite manufacturers to China in connection with satellite launches could have been used to improve Chinese intercontinental ballistic missile technology. In 2010, Rep. John Culberson urged President Barack Obama not to allow further contact between NASA and the China National Space Administration. In a letter addressed to the president, he wrote, I have grave concerns about the nature and goals of China's space program and strongly oppose any cooperation between NASA and CNSA's human spaceflight programs without congressional authorization. In April 2011, the 112th United States Congress barred NASA from engaging in bilateral agreements and coordination with China. As stated under Public Law 11210, Sector 1340A, None of the funds made available by this division may be used for the National Aeronautics and Space Administration or the Office of Science and Technology Policy to develop, design, plan, promulgate, implement, or execute a bilateral policy, program, order, or contract of any kind to participate, collaborate, or coordinate bilaterally in any way with China or any Chinese-owned company unless such activities are specifically authorized by a law enacted after the date of enactment of this division. B. The limitation in subsection A shall also apply to any funds used to effectuate the hosting of official Chinese visitors at facilities belonging to or utilized by the National Aeronautics and Space Administration. On June 25, 2024, with the return of the Chong Er 6 lunar mission, China acquired rocks and soil from the far side of the moon a historic milestone with the potential to revolutionize understanding of the moon's evolution and its capacity to support human life. The China National Space Administration announced that it would share these lunar samples with scientists worldwide, following the precedent set by NASA after the Apollo missions. However, according to an article from Futurism, U.S. scientists will be largely barred from participating in the analysis of these samples because of the Wolf Amendment unless NASA first receives certification from the FBI, proving that there are no national security threats.